with Cleveland way in the background. One of the one of the more fascinating ways and treacherous ways to take in winter's wildlife is to get down to the Cuyahoga River. You see, Lake Erie is getting locked up right now with ice. So the birds that prefer open water head into the Cuyahoga River. We have some ring-billed gulls right there. Canada geese, there's an American black duck out there. Let's take a closer look at some of these species. I'm naturalist Marty. There you go, take a look at these ring-billed gulls. Find that ring, that notch, right across the bill. You'll see these in parking lots, shopping centers, they're omnivorous, so they can eat meats and plant materials. They're very widespread, and their habitat is variable. Really, they can be found in many, many different places. Dozens of Canada geese here. It appears as though, woo, it appears as though they don't mind the cold water at all. Those feathers provide a good layer of insulation, keeping their bodies dry. So this is a Canada goose. Look for the white crescent right behind the eye. See that? I ventured into the woods and came across this 15 foot tall grass with these big plumes at the end of it. It's called common reed, better known as Phragmites. And it's on Ohio's top 10 most invasive non-native plant list. But even the bad plants have these hollow stems. And in the winter, I tell you what, inside of there, there's larvae of insects and there's other bugs calling this, calling this a safe haven to get through winter. Uh, are you kidding me? These birds are actually walking on this ice. Woo! You see, they have the ability to, to slow the blood, for, blood flow from their webbed feet up into their body, so that way it doesn't cool the warmer blood in their body. Woo! That's amazing. Well, they don't hold still for too long, but I did the work for you. Be sure to get out there this winter and find your own wildlife. I'm Naturalist Marty. Thanks for coming along on this virtual hike.